front of the biggest uh, crisis, humanitarian crisis. I felt guilty sometimes for doing nothing. And uh, just at that time, I received an email from a fellow MIT alum, Maisa Sabah, uh, about an article about entrepreneurship and refugees. We decided as a team to launch a Innovate for Refugee competition where anyone around the world, including the refugee population, could uh, apply providing a technology solution to a refugee problem. And if you start listing the refugee problems, all of them can be sorted out using technology. If you think of energy, by definition, is a technology problem. Water. Water is a technology problem, filters and all the technology that you put in place to provide drinkable water. 3D printing is a very nice example of what technology has been able to instantly provide within the refugee populations. This refugee crisis is all about identity. Uh, people rejecting some other people's identity, some people claiming their identity and their right to behave in a certain way, to eat in a certain way, to appear in a certain way. In Lebanon, the refugee crisis is a very big and important part of our daily lives because we're a population of barely 4 million and you've got 1.5 million refugees that are housed here. Uh, so that touches us obviously locally, but more on a humanitarian aspect for me. The idea that this is something global. It's no longer about just you know, a certain faction of uh, the population or a certain area. It's a crisis that affects everyone worldwide. In front of so much despair, probably when a humankind is most under stress or challenged, that this uh, very beautiful side of a human being has an even greater chance to appear. You see that a lot of people are willing to do something about it and it gets you thinking. You should also take the initiative and do something. And volunteering or coming up with an idea that can actually make a difference and change things. We should all take part of their solution to help them and to empower them, in fact. Look at how many people reacted, look at how many people decided to volunteer and try and change things. And this is uh, what we're trying to inspire people to do.